GOP tax reform bill will stop illegal immigrants from collecting tax credits. According to its authors, the new GOP tax bill will strip illegal immigrants of their ability to claim and collect several major tax credits. Doing so will save the federal government an estimated $23.1 billion over the next decade. The bill will do this by closing IRS loopholes and requiring all taxpayers to submit work-eligible social security numbers in order to claim tax credits. This may come as a shock to some who take for granted the assumption that illegal aliens don't receive state benefits especially tax credits. However, it's an open secret that the IRS has allowed illegal aliens who pay tax to collect a number of tax benefits, including the American Opportunity Tax Credit and the Earned Income Tax Credit. Although previous governments have attempted to end the spending, the IRS has maintained that it has the authority to interpret tax law, given that direction from Congress is often bare bones, and presidential direction, under Obama, was two-faced. While this presumption is generally accepted, this cannot be used to shield the IRS from specific congressional diktats. Now that President Trump controls the White House, the IRS will have no latitude to interpret the law as it sees fit, Trump is cracking down on illegal immigrants and the administration will need to fall in line. Finally, I feel compelled to remind our readers that tax credits are a paltry sum compared to government services consumed by illegal aliens. For example, illegal immigration costs the state of California $135 billion annually 17.7% of the state budget. This is primary reason why California's infrastructure is increasingly dilapidated, and its public schools are among the worst in the nation. Immigration is milking the American people dry, and Congress is finally moving in the right direction.